In the 1950s, the first sketches of the Roadster, which is still considered one of the most beautiful vehicles of all time, were produced by the New York-based industrial designer Albrecht Graf Goetz. In 1955, the BMW 507 was unveiled and immediately created an international sensation. The car was completely handmade and its aluminium body parts were hammered into shape on wooden forms. The Roadster also featured a lightweight V8 engine. The 507 was a must-have, even for the king of rock and roll, Elvis Presley. Filmmakers cast this beauty for leading parts. Oh, what do you say to the Ein there? A dead was Mach du immer mit deinen Autos. I want to eat. Ach, du denkst immer nur ans Essen. With 150 horsepower, the BMW 507 was definitely not top-notch in terms of performance. There were much more powerful cars in Europe, in particular from the Italian manufacturers. But what made this car special was its form, its beauty and the overall concept. But the price was problematic. It cost 27,000 marks, which was about the same price as a house at that time. Because of its price, the number sold was very, very low. When it comes to design history, the 220 horsepower BMW 507 is definitely one of the most important and most valuable cars. With a mere 253 cars produced between 1955 and 1959, the BMW 507 became a classic car in an instant.